Big birds just went flying. Well, hello there. I'm out here on my daily walk. Oh, it's quite a nice day. Laid in the grass for a good while, just staring up at the sky and doing nothing. Which is a very good thing to do sometimes, especially on lazy Sundays. And my back is kind of yeah. achy. But we're out on the walk, enjoying the breeze. Oh. <laughs> So, this is the part where I say something profound, I suppose. <laughs> something that has helped me with my own journey and mental health and stuff, finding inner peace, is uh, when you look back on the past, not to judge it. Because I know we have a tendency, and I, human, when we look back at the past, we want to ascribe values to things. Well, that was a good choice. Well, that was a bad choice. Well, you see, this was a good experience, and that was a bad one. And while I'm not trying to downplay the emotions of the moment, when you're looking back at your history retrospectively, it's far easier to use it for constructive learning purposes when you let go of the emotional baggage that's attached to it. That is the past that happened, that made me who I am, that brought me to this place. It's just the story of how we got here. And uh, sometimes broken roads lead to beautiful knives. So don't, don't be upset at yourself for not being perfect in the past, or even the present, nobody's perfect. That's just a made-up word to try and keep you from realizing that you are lovable just the way you are. Beautiful. Magical. Like the sky. That's pretty cool. So, yes. Uh -huh. Living in the moment. Use the past to plan to use the past to learn from, the future to plan for, but keep your heart in the now. Helps live a little bit more relaxed type life. It's quite quiet out, which is a very nice thing. Oftentimes the road noise can be quite loud, even all the way back here. I have to walk all the way down to Narnia just just to get away from the sound of the automobile. <laughs> Most of the trees are either fully in color now or they've lost a lot of their leaves. It was quite a windy day today and consequently a lot of leaves went flying through the air. I kept looking out the window and I'd see things fly through and I'm like, is that a bird? Nope, it's another leaf. It's a whole bunch of leaves. <laughs> hey, at least it's not snow flurries. The other night I saw a bat out here, and it was getting dark. Those are some pretty cool creatures. As are all the living things in nature. Oops, something just went flying by right past. Is it right past? Yes, the power of nature is remarkable. 
You see, city sidewalk all paved over and just little plant cracking up through the, busting its way through the cement just to reach its tender leaves up for a little bit of sunshine. Nature is persistent and patient. A lot of things you can learn from Mother Nature. Which is why I suggest spending time whenever you can with the wonderful trees and the grass and the flowers. Anyways, thank you for joining me on today, which is October 23rd, 2020, for a daily walk. I have to see if I can go find some new Doctor Who to watch. I heard it's coming out. Quite fun indeed. And I hope you have an absolutely marvellous day.